And here we are. So, can I do this without dying? Actually, I don't really care because all that's going to do is send me back to the start anyway. And I have to get out of here, so... No, 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 no. Get it, get it, get it. Now, jump. See, now, I got that one. Jeez. Oh, man. I wish I could have done that over there and saved myself tons of time. Okay, jump down. And we can get out of here. It didn't go too badly. I think um, I managed to find everything pretty close together without a lot of time wasted. Up until the end there, but that'll be edited out. This has been pretty cool, I suppose. Um, okay, so we're going to get out of here, and then I'm going to go open up our next world, and of course get that lair to eat. Um, 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 um. I think I have to go over here first. No, 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 never mind. I'm getting mixed up. I need to leave this area. Yeah. Okay, so we'll head down here and go outside of this area. And into this area. And... Think up here. Yeah. Here, there's a, uh, another no door. Um, um, okay, I'll go ahead and open that. With 160 to spare. But I'm trying to. Yeah, there it is. There it is. There's our jiggy. So, that is the ninth layer jiggy. There's only one left. What's in here? Gold feather. What's in here? Nothing. Okay. Cheapskate. <laughs> so, we're gonna go up here. And, uh, right. Water level again. I think this one's only temporary, yeah. Alright, actually, what the heck does that serve? What purpose does that serve? Just me not having to climb up there yet? Okay, whatever. Anyway. Oh, Swispers, how I hate thee. Um, see what I mean? Okay. Wasted some feathers, but what the heck. Um, yeah. So, we're in a new place. Look, the bull from Mumbo's Mountain is back. For his brother, anyway. Deal with him the same way, you can't kill him, but you can stun him with two red rat wraps. There's another note door, which we could also open. Uh, I don't think we have to, though, yet. Uh, let me see. I don't know why, but I'm blanking out on what I have to do. I know I have to find a switch. Here it is. Okay. That's that done. Um, I'm not sure if I have to worry about the rest of this, actually. This heads back out to... Yeah, Mumbo Token and... Right, right back here. That's good. Um, okay, so now we'll be going back a ways in the lair to find that puzzle piece switch thing you just saw. Um, I gotta find the other cauldron. Hang on, here it is. Yeah, I said I wouldn't be using these cauldrons, but here I am using cauldron. I don't know. Maybe when I was younger, I just liked wasting time walking around in um, different parts of the lair, but now it just seems a bit silly. Oh, you. Mm. You know what? That's what you get for that, growling. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna be going up in here. 
and you might remember this area that pair of eyes down there going to Treasure Trove Cove's entrance that hill up there going in the direction of Bubblegood Swamp but down here is something else and here it is the puzzle switch for click clock Word. In that area where we saw the bow and all that, heads right to that entrance. I'm um, over here. I think there's a yes, token. There's nothing. There's Martilda. I think there's a gold feather. No, extra life, cool. And I don't think there's anything over here. No. Okay, so that's it. Click Clock Wood is open. Uh, we are... Wow, just so close to the end of this game. We now have only the 10 Jiggies in Click Clock Wood plus 1 Blair Jiggy. 11 Jiggies, and we will have completed this game. And another 100 notes, and 2 more but anyway yeah so that's it I guess we'll wrap up this session um, I have been Jonathan Wolf 038 this has been Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie and I uh, hope you enjoyed it uh, I'm kinda of glad to be done with it actually looking forward to Clip Clock Wood bye